how's it going everybody? Oh my gosh, hold on a second. Little bugger didn't think I spotted him. Dun dun, dun dun, dun 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 dun. Sriya! Got him! What the heck is this thing? Ooh, I caught a violin beetle. All right, first time catching one of those, uh, this town. I've caught those before in the past. Hey, how's it going everybody? It is Mayor Joshi here. Welcome back to the Animal Crossing New Leaf video journal. My town is a complete worthless dump and I have to do something about that. Um, what should we do? I, I know uh, there's a lot of stuff I want to do. This whole journal I think is going to be a whole lot of just doing a whole lot of stuff. Um, but first I want to go into my house and see if there's like stuff in my pockets that I want to keep and uh, some of the stuff I might want to sell. Um, yeah, I do want to keep this. The sea snail. Um, the mush lamp. I think I want to keep the mush lamp as well. I'm living like a hobo underneath a railroad track. I've got no space to move around. I'm like one of those fish, those beta fishes where they just exist in like a cup. I feel like a little beta fish and I'm not happy about Oh, I can't put that on because it goes on the wall. Uh, pilot goggles. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I have those too, but I hate the way they look. <laughs> I don't really want to walk around looking like that. I think that kind of looks dumb. It's kind of neat, but I don't know, I just don't. I'm not, I'm not crazy about the way that looks, if I'm being honest with you. Um, let's put the mush thing on the wall. Uh, I really can't do that very easily, I guess, huh? How am I gonna do this? There we go. Um, I think it can go above the window, let's see. Bop, bada, bop, bop, yep it can. So yeah, I like the mushroom stuff. I think the mushroom furniture is pretty cool. Definitely reminds me of fall, and uh, it's uh, it's one of my favorite little special furniture setups that Animal Crossing has. Uh, this stuff I want to keep. Actually, that flooring I don't want to keep. Um, let's put that back on. Um, the flooring can go. Don't worry, I promise we're going to be doing lots of fun, exciting things in this journal, but let's be honest, if you wanted to watch me start this town from scratch, this is the kind of stuff that's got to go on. Okay, let's see. I can drop these saplings. Wait, what are those things? Are those? Oh, those are bushes. Okay, I bought those from my Japanese town. Uh, oh, that's right. We can go into town and go to the uh, the garden shop now because that's open and I can get some more bushes. I got to keep doing that every day because I'm going to need bushes. I want to get like Christmas looking bushes and uh, I think we might start doing some gardening in my front yard today. Start planting some things. Uh, got cherries as my town fruit, by the way. Do I have my shovel? No, I don't have my shovel on me. It doesn't matter. Let's keep going. A lot of bugs out today. This town sure is buggy today. What's my approval rating? That's the other thing. I kind of feel like... Oh, hello. Do I have space for that? Yeah, heck I do. I kind of feel like... Um, getting Having to get your approval rating up before you can build stuff is a real pain in the butt. Ore? Oh, I have some ore. I just picked it up. And there's one more. I, 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 can, I can get the uh, rock for the day. That was just sitting there from yesterday. But let's go in and sell a few things. Then we're going to make our way to the uh, shopping center. Whatever that, what is that called? Shopping, not the shopping center. The, uh, uh, I totally forget. I forget. Main Street. Is it called Main Street? Could be called Main Street. Let's say that. All right, all right, all right, all right. And uh, I think that's pretty much it. We just saw a bunch of junk. <clears throat> Start crunching those numbers, Reese. That's me crunching on the numbers. Ooh, 5,247 bells. Ooh, that sounds better than okay, baby. Sounds fantastic, Reese. La, la, da, dee, da, dee, do, dee. Look at him sleeping away. I love his little drawings, his little architecture. Well, I guess it's not architecture. It's like blueprints for furniture. Furniture is not architecture. It can be if it's done really well. I wouldn't mind living in a house that's shaped like a sofa. All right, let's make our way up to Main Street. Is it Main Street? I really want to know now. I don't know. Main Street, I might be thinking of Disney. Disney World. <laughs> I, I'm only writing this to improve my approval rating. <clears throat> that was from Mayor Joshi there. Heck of a guy. All right, well, let's go. Ooh, Punchy. A lot of people say they're jealous that I have Punchy living here. A lot of people are a big fan of Punchy with his catchphrase of Mfft. Let's see what he's got to say. Let's chat with him for a bit. I heard a rumor about you. Oh God, there are many rumors about me going around on the internet. Half are true and half are untrue. I'll let you decide which ones are true. Everyone's saying you're a kind of bell pincher. How dare you? 
Bell pincher implies that I'm cheap, right? Cheap? I'm not cheap. Actually, I have not spent a lot of money in this game so far. Like, I haven't bought a lot of things. All right, here we go. Uh, let's kick it off with the uh, the Able Sisters. I, there, oh my gosh, guys, there are so many cool QR code patterns that I found on the internet for like um, Christmassy winter sweaters and things, and I really want to scan them. But of course, as you might know, uh, you got to build up a relationship with Abel first. You got to talk to her like every day. I think it's Abel. Abel or Sable. I forget which one is which. I'll take it. It's a nice little winter hat. I'm looking for a lot of good winter clothing. Gesture hat is pretty stupid looking. I don't need that. Da -da 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 -de -do. Hi. Oh, she's Mabel. So the other one is Sable. What do we got going on in here? Oh, brown pants. Brown pants. Ooh. Brown formal pants. I like brown formal pants. I'll buy it. Got a fireman uh, jacket and all stuff. All right. Ooh, look what you're making, Sable. She's making a little froggy pattern. Come on, love me, Sable. Love me, Sable. Love me. I want to use a QR code thing, Sable. Why won't you love me, Sable? Oh, I just had a moment there. I just don't like when things don't like me. I want everything to love me. Everybody must approve of me, even fictional characters. All right, let's go get some plants. I'm gonna take some seeds and put them in my pants. Oh, I love this guy, look at him. I, get, I, I gotta be honest, I'm really sad when his shop is just part of Nookington's. I like his shop being this cute little flower shop thing and you get the good music. Um, we don't, we only want the, we want the cedar sapling, but I don't want the flowers. I, I got enough flowers. My Japanese town is just like loaded with them. If my Japanese town was cake, the flowers would be the frosting. And there's a lot of frosting in my Japanese town. Uh, so yeah, we don't need flowers. Why pay money for things we can get for free? Oh, look at those birdies! Next up, we're gonna go to Nooklin Junction. Nooklin Junction. Uh, Nookling Junction is a little depressing. There's really not usually a lot of stuff to want in here. Oh, I spoke too soon. Actually, he's got a cool totem going on back here. I don't really want it because there's nothing I can use it for at this time of the year. Um, and I can't use the play coins because I have not moved around with my 3DS. So this was a worthless visit. Bye, Tommy. It's weird that Tom Nook's nephew is named after him. Very strange. That means that his sister or brother named their child after their brother. That doesn't, it's sort of weird. Let's go to Nook's Homes though. Cause I do want to start, I want to maybe get like a gingerbread theme for my house. That could work. I want to get a nice wintry house. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. Oh, he's just talking about this. I think I can pay off my next loan to make it bigger. Yeah, 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 Lyle, nobody likes you. Lyle, you're the most worthless character in Animal Crossing. You stupid idiot. Look at you with those glasses. They make you look so smart and those whiskers. Arr, I just want to snuggle them. Actually, um, I like the way Lyle looks, but he is such a worthless character. Da, da, dee. Um, doesn't really look like you got anything I want today, Nook. Why do you always have crap, Tom Nook? Uh, how do I pay off the loan? Do I, I think I go to the uh, post office to do that, so let's do it. Thanks much. Welcome much. Post office is, uh, it's kind of worthless in this game, because the only way you can mail letters to your friend is when you're in their town. You have to go to their post office to send them a letter. That don't make no sense. That's why Animal Crossing City Folk is way better than people think, because you could actually send letters from your post office to your friend's town via the online servers. It's the only Animal Crossing game to allow you to do that too, by the way. Um, I don't wanna do anything with her. Why did I talk to her? Cause she's cute, that's why I talked to her. I think this is where I pay back my loan, right? Yeah, repay loan. How much do I owe on this? Uh, it says that I owe, oh, I've got, we can pay that back. It was under 40,000 bells. So that's been totally paid off. We'll get a nice bigger house. Oh no! I finished paying off my home loan. I'm an adult, look at me. I have a pocket protector, and I like to use mousse in my hair so that it stays nice and slick and I look like a businessman. 
I'm a businessman. Hello, Digby. I'm a businessman. I paid off my loan. La 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 la. All right, let's go to the campsite. Oh man, for some reason I just got dizzy doing that. Whenever I pretend to be an adult, I get dizzy. Good thing I don't do that too much. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Oh, oh, there's some Christmas flowers right there. We're gonna keep. Oh, there's a Christmas grasshopper. Ooh, a mushroom. Hello. Uh, what? Oh, 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 that's right. I forgot to get my meow coupons. Meow. We've got... One? I had one coupon? What the heck? What did I do to get one coupon? That was pretty lame. Oh. I'm stuck in a hole. Okay, let's go to the campground. I, are there such things as pitfalls in Japan? Is that like a common thing in Japan? Because I've never heard of a pitfall. Like, a, oh, oh, oh! Oh, he's feeding the bro! Oh my god! No! <laughs> oh, he's feeding the birds! Look at them all! Holy crap! Guys, guys, look at this! <laughs> Well, you know, you know what's coming, right? You know what I gotta do. <laughs> oh wow, he just got. Oh, oh, oh! I'm gonna sit here. <laughs> this is fantastic. Ah, oh, this is all I ever want to do in life. I want to virtually watch a hippie dog at a campground feed fake birds. Oh my God, how many are gonna come here? <laughs> Why am I getting so much enjoyment out of this? Oh, look at him. I want to feed him. Can I feed him? Let's talk to him. Yeah, 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 I scared him away. Hey, what are you doing? How can I help you? Uh, I'm going to say, hey, Harv. Harv? Oh, you mean me. Um, how do we know? Each he never remembers who I am. Stop and smell it. Yeah, he's saying the same stuff that he always says. I want to feed him. There's beans that you can throw. In um, in the Japanese version of this game, there's like a bean day or something. Bean festival. I want to throw them. Harvey. What's this thing? Wooden bear. Hey. Do I want that wooden bear? Yeah, I think I do. I can barely stand how cool that item is. What is this? Is that Professor... Is that Dr. Shrunk, actually? It could be Dr. Shrunk. Harvey, let me throw some. Is there any option for me to say, hey, give me that? What can I do here? I said, hey, you Harv. Yeah, he's not really... Oh, wait, he is talking about the birds. I think we could all learn a thing or two from them, myself included. Tell me more about the birds. What did he say? How do we know each other? Just look at this piece of the place. Watch it, watch the birds flitting to and fro. Mind where you're standing, though. That's right where uh, nature calls. Okay. Do you want to feed the birds too? Oh, what? Some places they tell you not to feed the birds, but birds got to eat too, man. Oh, oh, so he's probably giving me that little thing that you get in Bean Day, right? Let's see. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, it's the same thing. Yeah, so they give this out in Japan. Do they come to me when I throw them? Oh. <laughs> oh my god! Animal Crossing, will you marry me? <laughs> I'm gonna sit on a little bench and throw it. Can I do that? Yes, I can! Oh my god! This has been... Oh, life is good. Life is pretty darn fantastic. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know if this is entertaining to you guys, but it sure as heck is to me. I wish there were more than just yellow birds. There should be like green and blue and red birds. Here you go, guys. Eat up. Get nice and fat so you can't fly anymore. All right. I could do that forever, but we should probably see who's camping here. So do I get to keep that now? I think I do. I wonder if the birds come to me outside of the campground. Like if I use that in my town, do birds show up then? Oh wait, this isn't Dr. Shrunk, this is Blanca. And I love how they gave Blanca a face. Does she usually have a face? No, I don't think she does. Hey there, don't mind me, I'm just your average everyday camper. It's a nice campground, isn't it? You're not average everyday camper, you're a special character. 
Hey, I'm not the prankster you think I am. Today is an April Fool's Day, so you can just relax. Oh, you're wondering about my face? I just thought I'd try out a little makeup. What do you think? Huh. So Blanca's description, I always like to read the descriptions for you guys. It's on the bottom screen. I'll just read it for you. It says, Sure, she likes to stir up trouble around the town, but when you see her out relaxing at the campground, she looks so... Well, she looks pretty creepy. <laughs> That's pretty great. I love how they kind of gave Blanca even more of a backstory in New Leaf. What does she look like when I when she's shocked? Oh crap, she turned around. Turn this way so we can see your face when, I, when you get shocked. Turn around, Blanca. Look at the camera, you smug little... Oh, I don't think it changes. I think it's just drawn on so she doesn't... Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bye, Blanca. Blanca's a cool character. I like her. A lot of weird mysteriousness going on. I mean, think about it. We kind of take it for granted, but when you stop and think, she's a character whose face is missing, and you draw her face on for her. Oh, the birds don't really seem to follow me when I'm not over there. Hey, guys. Oh, no, they do. They Yeah, they show up. Seems like they might only show up in certain areas, though. Man, I, man, I love all these little birds. All right. There's birds everywhere on that campsite. Let's go test it and see if the birds come to me in the town. I'm going to say they probably won't. The whole bird population seems to congregate at the campground, but let's try it. No. No, doesn't seem like they like to come. They don't eat in the town. No. <laughs> now I just look like a maniac. Huh. Well, that was fun. We've gotten nothing done today, because I spent a good five minutes feeding birds. Hey, we found something. That was a mushroom. It's a mush dresser. So one of my goals, I think, is going to be to collect all the mushroom stuff. How's my tree coming along? Pretty well. We got two branches. Look, it's a butt tree. It's, well, it's a butt or a boob tree. You decide. You decide what kind of tree that is. We got to talk to my buddy Gaston. I'm impressed to see that you're surviving. Okay. He thinks so little of me, he thought I would be dead by now. Thank you, Gaston. Let's chat with him. It seems like you're kind of curious about me, aren't you? Uh, I don't know what you heard, Gaston, but I don't swing that way. All right, I'll let you experience my world as much as you want. Feel free to hang out at my place. Yeah, let's go do it. Let's get going. All right, we're going to Gaston's place. Uh, where do you live exactly, Gaston? No, I'm not there. Come on, this way. Oh, hold on, I gotta water those flowers. Gotta get my approval rating up. There we go. Um, let me just check the map. No, no, no. Yep, there. Oh, we're by Gaston's house. Okay. I'm pretty happy with all of my villagers. They're pretty cool. That's my house. All right, come in and let's do this. Hee <laughs> hee, we're going to hang out at Gaston's house. Um, I am probably going to do a lot of work, um, like behind the scenes outside of these videos to fix up the town and ready it for Christmas time. Um, so you will see like a lot of differences each journal probably from here on out. Well, look around all you want. Okay, I'm looking around. Hey, did I, oh, he bought, oh, that's right. He bought this mush table from the retail shop and I was the one that put it on sale and then he displayed it. I mean, I know the animals do that, but it just kind of took me by surprise. Um, you know, I think I still like my sloppy bed though. <laughs> okay, sloppy bed. There we go. I love how creepy Gaston's house is. Look at this. It's like this weird dump, scary music, garbage can. What? Oh, that's right. I can throw stuff away. Well, Gaston, you have a heck of a house, let me tell you. But I need to leave because the smell is just... I'm about to pass out. What do I think of his room? I think it's awesome. Okay. May, ooh, we're increasing our friendship with Gaston. Loving it. So we're looking at about 20 minutes almost here. Um, getting kind of close to that. I, again, I kind of feel like we didn't really necessarily do anything in this trip. I love all my villagers. They're all fantastic. Here's Anka. See what she has to say. Help keeping Hokotate green. Okay, got it. Um, I think we probably should go and check out what my approval rating is because I really want to get that up so I can start building some stuff like signboards and uh, various other things. I'm also going to be doing a lot of planting 
Uh, it's not really fun to watch somebody plant things in Animal Crossing for like an hour, so I'll probably do that um, outside of these journals. But uh, we got to get our planting on. And I'm thinking cherries are what I should plant for Christmas. But I'm also going to plant a lot of cedar saplings. All right, Isabel. Come here. Tell me how much people approve of me. Yes. Oh, wow. Whoa, I did not expect that at all. Wow, people love me around here. I've done it. Uh, for some reason, I had a hell of a time trying to get my approval rating up, like, in the past. This time, it seemed really easy. Approval process will take one day at the very least, but it could take up to a few days. What? If you could come by and check on its approval... What? What are you talking about? I thought you just said that I was approved. Uh... Okay, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure my approval rating is all the way up, right? Let's just talk to her one more time. Granger, I haven't heard anything back yet. Town development prayer. Get approved. Okay, whatever. So, I, I got 100%, though. I guess she's waiting for paperwork or something. I don't know. I don't know. She's crazy. She's crazy, crazy, crazy. But yeah, there you go. I'm 100% approved by the citizens. Pretty happy with that. And uh, I think on that note, we'll probably put an end to this journal for now. I'll be back very, very soon. I'm gonna do a little bit of planting in the in the town tonight. I want to kind of strategically decide where my bushes are going, where my trees are going. And then when you guys see me next, you'll uh, start to see that underway. I'm very excited. I've got a lot of cool ideas to make this the ultimate Christmas Christmas themed town. Until next time, I will see you wonderful little peeps later. Thank <laughs> you.